channel so this video is going to be a skincare routine video these are the products that I use personally on a daily basis if not every day about four or five days a week so let's just get right into it so every morning when I wake up I go into my bathroom brush my teeth and then I wash my face I wash my face with the clean and clear morning burst I'm currently using the shine control uh, facial cleanser because um, I have oily skin and actually it's kind of oily and dry at the same time now sometimes so this is what I use in the mornings I feel like when I wake up my skin is so greasy and disgusting and this really helps me personally feel like my skin is being clean it has like the little beads in it you can't see that it's green and yellow they dissolve right away almost actually I kinda like, like to take some of them and rub it on my face and let them dissolve into my skin but I like this um, I think I got it for four or five ninety nine at Harmons. There, it's cheap. I personally like the pump because I feel like with like squeeze tubes, squeeze things, um, that I take too much. So that's what I use in the morning. So I guess the next would be like after I apply my makeup and I had my whole long day and I go to take my makeup off. So the first thing I use is the Neutrogena Extra Gentle Eye Makeup Remover Pad. You've seen these in my empties videos and maybe my favorites and this is what I use to take off my eye makeup um, only because I feel like these they don't irritate my eyes and make them burn like some other products that I've tried and I'm not going to name names but this is what's worked best for me I'm debating on getting the liquid um, a, well, a liquid eye makeup remover but this works just fine for me and then I'll take my face makeup off and I'm using the makeup remover cleansing towels by Neutrogena. This I took with me when I went to Atlantic City for my cousin's wedding, so it kind of got smashed in my suitcase. So I use this. But the next one I'm going to use is the Clean and Clear Makeup Dissolving Facial Cleansing Wipes. It instantly dissolves dirt, oil, and makeup, even waterproof mascara. I purchased this because I had a coupon. I had, I think, a one or two dollar off coupon off of a clean and clear product so I figured what the heck I'll just try it and then after I do that I take the Clinique take the day off cleansing balm um, you apply this to your skin dry uh, it's literally a cleansing balm you kinda like dig your finger into it and then as you um, like use your fingertips to warm like warm it up I guess it turns into an oil and I put this all over my face and I rub it on my eyes and it doesn't bother my eyes it's I think it uh, doesn't it says you can remove it with eye makeup um, use it on your eyes to remove eye makeup so that this is what I use after my makeup remover wipes and I love this I saw this on someone's skincare routine I don't remember who it was but I figured I'd pick it up from Sephora and if I didn't like it then I didn't like it but I think I got this for $20, $21, I think it was. And I love it, so. I forgot to mention, this was $6.99. I want to say this was $6.99, and this is $4.99, I think. And then I use Philosophy, uh, the Purity uh, One Step Facial Cleanser. Um, this also takes up makeup, so I after I rinse this off with warm water, I wash my face with this um, because I just feel like this does what it needs to do. I was iffy on purchasing it because I think it's twenty something dollars, twenty four dollars or something like that, twenty one dollars. I don't remember exactly, but I was iffy on purchasing it, and I went to the store and I didn't get it, and then I went home. And then eBay sent me an email that Sephora was having like 8% cash back. So I figured I'll just buy it and if I don't like it, I'll return it. And I love it. I'm so happy I purchased it. So if I already took a shower in the morning and then put makeup on, this is what I do. But if I um, didn't take a shower before I put makeup on, I'll do this routine and then I'll go in the shower and wash my face again. So what I'm using right now is Daily Facial Cleanser. Um, this is kind of like, this is like Cetaphil's, but it's like, it's the um, Whole Foods brand of it. 
I've had this for a really, really long time. And I saw Elias for Living's video and she was doing the bus video, backup stash, like to get rid of all your backup stuff. Well, not to get rid of it, but like to finish stuff so you can use your backup stash. So I had this for a while and I really wanted to get rid of it and use it. So this is what's in my shower now. It does what it's supposed to do. It cleanses my face. I don't remember how much it costs because I got it probably two years ago and I know that's really bad, but I don't think it has an expiration date. And it still foams up. It doesn't bother my skin. It doesn't dry it out. This is for normal to oily skin. Um, so, I mean, this does what it's supposed to do. I'm, I, I'm not like, oh, I have to buy it again, but it does the job. But And the next thing I'm going to use, because I personally like to change up my face washes in the shower every time I run out, mainly because I don't want my skin to get used to one product, because... I want to make sure it's all working because I had acu uh, I had acne and I went on Accutane and I want to take really good care of my skin. So that is why I change it up all the time. What I just purchased, actually my mom purchased it for me, is the Oil Free Acne Stress Control Power Clean Wash uh, by Neutrogena. I was looking at this at my job at Harman's and I was like, I really need to get this. Even though I don't really get acne anymore, I'll get like a spot on occasion. I want, I personally want to keep using salicylic acid because I want to make sure my skin stays nice and this is what I purchased next. I have no review on it yet because I haven't used it. Um, this was $6.99 I think and I also had a coupon so I got it cheaper. And then as a moisturizer when I get out of the shower after I wash my face, um, I use the Survey Moisturizing Lotion for normal to dry skin. Um, I This doesn't bother my skin even though I have oily like combination kind of skin now. Um, this is just fine for me. You see this in my favorites video. I still am using this and I don't even know when this thing is ever going to be empty. Let's see. Yeah, there's like a quarter left because I just used my light. And um, I love this. I already have a backup and it's not like I'm going to get rid of it so this I think is $12.99 it's kind of expensive but it's a really good product if you can afford it and it lasts a super long time so I use this and like a half a pump of this I use also the Tarte Maracuja oil um, I got it from Sephora it's like $46 for this thing but you don't need a lot and I know it's kind of expensive but I think it's worth it I use three drops in combination with this and I rub it in my hands and I put it all over my face and neck. Um, and I love it. And I think it's totally worth the price. My friend Alexandra Parker here on YouTube actually gave me a little tiny sample size and I was obsessed with it. So that is my current skincare routine, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any suggestions on something I should add to my skincare routine, please let me know because I'm looking for new products like for youth code and stuff like that. So. Till next time, guys. Bye.